into what is good guys it is your boy F R double E coming back with it again just chilling out and as you can see I got something new going on here indeed indeed it's that PS5 no doubt guys um I know they've been hard to get you know with these scalpers or what do they call them scalpers butters it's just it's a pain you know it's been a pain in the ass for people to get one of these things but all I can say is just keep at it man you know they had um I got mine for the the sale that was Wednesday so it was the day before Thanksgiving you know they had certain waves and Walmart had their um I don't know if it was a pre Black Friday deal or not but Walmart had a wave where they um started them it was 9 p.m. Eastern time so my time it was 7 p.m. and I, I kept at it you know for about I, it was probably the first five minutes I'd say I mean it, it seemed like I had it in my cart like after the first minute and and I, I literally just you know once it, I was trying to check it out it just it kept giving me an error you know it was saying something like cart error cannot check out or something and you know I, I probably refreshed like about geez I'd say 50 times and and I kind of got a little distraught so I said you know I'm, I'm not gonna get it I, I got beat by the botters I'm done so this, I mean, I'm, I'm trying to be on the minute here because, you you know, with this, you, you, you've got to be on the minute. So, okay, so I would say this was about 7.07 after the sale started, which was 9 p.m. Eastern, 7 p.m. my time. It was about 7.07 .07 when I finally said, you know what, I'm done. I'm, I'm going to give up. So then I went and checked my email, and I did a couple other things for a couple minutes for, I'd say, about three, four, five minutes and it seemed like when I looked on my clock, it was about like, I mean, you know, this this is what I'm saying. Just You got to just stick with it, guys. So when I looked at my clock, you know, my um, my, my clock on, on my computer, because, you know, I'm, I was doing this from my laptop. It was like 714, and I was like, you know what, 15 minutes late. I mean, yeah, right, but maybe there's that hope. So I went back, and, and you know, it was like I said, about 714, 715. I just kept hitting refresh refresh fresh 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 for about two three four five minutes and I'd say it was about around 720 as you know you get that one instance of add to cart you jump at it so once I seen that add to cart instance I jumped you know I, I added it to cart and um I, I was kind of thinking okay well you know it's gonna get stuck on the next part and it didn't you know it actually got me it didn't give me the error it had put it in my car and, and show me the, the checkout price and everything and I was like wow this may go you know awesome so uh, I went ahead and pressed checkout and it was spinning you know the dreaded the circle the, <laughs> the circle of life <laughs> the dreaded circle spinning there so I was like oh no you know it's gonna freeze on me or what and, and it, it seemed like it was going a little slower I'm, I'm sure you know there, there was traffic within you know from from seven o'clock to who knows how many other people were doing the same thing and and about three four minutes later finally you know I just get that that um, on my screen where you know it says check out complete or something and blah 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 just tells you here's your order number thank you for your order you will receive your order and how many every day three to seven days and I was like yeah so it turned out pretty smooth you know I got it that Wednesday and it actually took a, an exact week to get here because they notified me Wednesday a week after which was two days from today so it got here um, I don't know what time it got here but I, I got the notification in the morning it was like about 8 in the morning and you know it, it said that it was able to be picked up between noon and 4 so I was like great so you know I, I went about 2 and got my PS5 so I'm pretty excited guys you know I mean your boy Freestyle Steve, I, I'd, I'd have to say, you know, for as much as I say I'm a gamer and stuff, I mean, I'm, I'm fairly new to the, uh, the play, not PlayStation itself. <laughs> I was actually probably one of the first ones to even get a PlayStation One here in my, uh, in my city, you know. I swear, man. I mean, it, so, so not that, but just this, you know, ever since they've acquired, I guess you could say, a network like the PlayStation Network, PlayStation Plus, whatever all this is you know I'm new I I, had, I got a PS2 and I, I didn't get any anything after no PS3 no PS4 the last new 
you know, brand new console I got was a Wii, so that was whenever the Wii came out. I, I'm, I, I can't even pray, place an exact date on that, you know, dur during the whole time that the uh, the tweezers, the Twilight uh, tweezers hack, you know, those were the, kind of the early ways to mod the Wii, so I, that was the last newest system I had got was the Wii, then some, some years after that, I ended up picking a, up a used 360, you know, nice 360 with the 512 uh, gigabyte hard drive, so it's got a lot of space, and then about a year after that, I got a PSP and my shield, so I guess you can say the Wii wasn't exactly the last newest system, I mean, you know, we do look at the Wii as a gaming system, whereas the Shield, uh, you know, they call it the streamer for gamers. I, I don't know if we can call our NVIDIA Shield Android TV. I, I, I play games on it. I use it for GeForce and game stream. So to me, it's it's a kind of, you know, hybrid, if you want to say pass through. I don't know what, what I could, what the term would even be, you know, gaming system. So the last newest system I got, I guess you could say would be the Shield. But if we want to go pure gaming system, that was the Wii. So you know, it's 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 pretty new to me. I mean, like I said, I didn't get a PS3 or a PS4 or an Xbox One. So this is kind of you know my first go of a well besides the Wii, but that was that was that generation of console, you know. So it's it's kind of cool. I'm, I'm still getting used to this interface and you know this whole. Uh, PlayStation Network, and, and as you guys can see, that that's if you want to add me, there you go, Steve. You know, Freestyle Steve. I was gonna go by Freestyle Steve, but Steve S. You know, boom. Feel free to add me. I'm gonna have to change my settings too, cause I I, I like to kind of I have it where it's just like friends and stuff, but I I, I kind of like connecting with a lot of people and having a fun game experience. So I'm definitely gonna probably go into that, but I'm def you know just kind of glad I got one of these. I know how hard they've been and just it's been a pain in the butt you know especially for you know people that just want to get one these scalpers have to ruin it and then there's there's you know I'm, I'm not saying that everybody's gonna do that but there's the opportunity too that if you do get one you can make a you know now just with with how hard they are to get you you can make a little bit of a profit if you want to but you know i i didn't not buy mine that for that reason at all i, I bought it for myself to use but there is always that option out there like you know somebody might get one and might be like well I can really use the extra whatever I can make off of it you know and just get one later and, and it seems like you know I, I kind of kept an eye on on the market they are in, inflating them they're going for a little bit more I mean I, I see <clears throat> to me it seems like I've seen you know at the I don't know if you want to call this the median like the average ladder end of the price scale but you know I've, I've seen them go for easily you know for like 800 plus 925 950 I've seen the highest I've actually seen one that went was for 1199 so 1200 bucks you know I mean I've seen some that have been listed for and this is eBay for like 1675 1500 and they haven't actually sold at that price but I was looking at one the other day and it was 1525 or best offer and they got some best offers so so who knows what the highest best off offer is but like I said the one I the highest one I've actually seen that was a completed auction on eBay and I, I think they started it off at like seven ninety nine. It got eleven ninety nine so you know there there's that um margin of profit there. But for everybody one and one don't <laughs> don't give in, you know, just stick with it man. I mean you know don't unless you unless you know, you you have that kind of money, and you can just say, yeah, whatever. But yeah, just just get one, you know, for for the retail price. Or if you get one for the retail price, and hey, you make a little profit, that's fine. But yeah, I mean, I don't know if it's fine, but I just I had no intentions on doing that. Just especially since they're so hard to get. But yeah, just keep with it, man. You know, I did, and like I said, I even got mine. It, it had to be like after 7:20. I'm surprised I got one. But I just stuck there on my laptop and kept refreshing, 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 refreshing. I mean, and this was 20 minutes after the sale, so I must have been very, very lucky. Because I was even like, wow. You know, once I seen that, the cart pop up and, and I went through the whole process. I was like, did I just, did this just happen? So, you know, they're just, a any given minute, you know, there there could be, maybe some somebody can put one in their cart and not check it out. 
or check it out and then cancel it or you know so just just keep at it like I did and you're gonna get it but we're just gonna do a quick you know quick little um, little run through here I haven't played this too too much I mean I only got a few games I really wanted to play this right here but the the kind of bummer thing with this right now is that the saves ain't transferring over from computer and I've, I've kind of you know from PC they have iOS Android and, and PC saves which are cross compatible or I guess you could say the saves carry over and then you got the PlayStation which doesn't which is kind of bummer I'm hoping they could do something to that you know because I think I have mine linked to my Twitter so all it would have to do would be somehow some way to sign into Twitter through here then hopefully I would be able to, to carry my save over here I don't really want to start all over again you know which I mean I could but I was kind of I didn't expect that I didn't really look into it too much but so that was kind of bummer and you know I just got some of the PlayStation Plus games I guess these you get to have you know for the, the duration that you are subscribed there's 20 of them this was one of the free ones for the month so I got that and I think bug snacks was too and then it's just cause and something else and this was um yeah that's the PS4 uh, plus collection so yeah I'm still definitely um getting into this you know I kind of like this little Astros playroom though it's kind of cool to show what you can do with the uh, system you know but yeah guys just stick with it you know stay adamant um, look out for when they announce those sales you know a lot of time they'll tell you ahead of time you know Walmart will be having Black Friday sales starting at 7 p.m. online or whatnot so just just keep keep at it you know uh, I mean, that, that kind of sucks for somebody wanting to uh, for somebody that would want to get one and, and pay you know a lot lot of money yeah let's go ahead and do it not like I need my stuff saved so this is you know this Astro Playroom just basically built to show you some of the uh, be it's kind of cool I kind of like what they did here you know like it's really really cool just for being kind of like a a demo it's, it's a game demo but it's, it's, they kind of put a good concept here going on and look how it just goes through the uh, history of PlayStation. You can see all the systems and what's new and what's old. And that's that's kind of cool, you know. Kind of definitely cool. So this is just going to basically, you know, we got shows you how the triggers work. You can see them moving, but then when you go down and it, it clicks, you know, it'll actually see the throttle and stuff. You'll feel that you could feel, and then you notice it pans. It pans with the uh, sound. So if I do the left, it's coming more out of my left um, ear earphone, and then if I do the right, it comes out of my right earphone. So that, that's kind of groovy, you know. And then the touchpad, you could kind of mess with it and see where you're at. You could click it, see when you click it. Kind of sweet. That's cool motion sensor it just shows you you know it throws them in there and they kind of you move it around and it rumbles and stuff and then it should go to where you can blow it on the bottom yeah the microphone see I'm even talking and it picks it up I'm not blowing in it but watch when I blow in it that's kind of cool So they give you a couple like little levels here. I think there's one that's like memory, like you know for computer memory, memory lane, solid state drive or something. It's kind of interesting, kind of groovy. So you know now it's telling you what to do. It's saying swipe up on the touchpad. So we just launched him, look, he launched out of the controller. It's kind of groovy. Just a little demo, but it's telling you how to, how to run around with him, you know. 
Now it's going to tell you how to jump with the X button, so... It's going to say jump again. Now it's telling you to jump and hold the X button, so see how, how it shows you? Kind of groovy. Yeah. Let's see, and then like, you probably have to... And it, it, it's cool, you know? Like little... Turn that on and... Yay! And now we're like at the... We're at the core now! So now it's telling, it's telling him how to punch, you know? He's gotta open it. Oh. Right. Now he's gotta pull the, uh... And it shows you what to do, you know? You go up and press square to latch onto it and just pull back. Yay! So th that's like the intro, you know. Now I think these are the levels. So we'll, we'll get into it more, maybe for my next video. I, I didn't want to go past the 15 minutes, but I think I did. But so these are the levels, kind of cool. Like dip, like you know, I wouldn't say all computer opponents, but you know, you got like the PlayStation. I think one of them's a CPU Plaza. That's what they call it. You know. Well, yeah. Okay. That's CPU Plaza. And then like, that's Cooling Springs. Look at that. And what is this one? Network Speed Run. <laughs> yeah. That's kind of cool. GPU Jungle. Solid State Drive Speedway. PlayStation Labo. So it's kind of cool, you know? I mean, I'm, I'm pretty sure they got a lot of cool little things going on here. I'm, I'm thinking we'll definitely... Uh, Memory Meadow. Haha. <laughs> awesome, huh? I'm thinking we'll definitely um, do some more videos. Now that I got a PS5, I feel like, you know, I can actually get down on some gamage for you guys. That's what's up. And, and I'll definitely get me some more stuff like I want to buy the camera you know a couple accessories that come out but um that's really all I wanted to do was just kind of check in and say what's up you know hopefully everybody's still on board with me I'm thinking I'll have some new music coming out here soon I, I got a bunch of freestyles and I have plans to drop some albums so I may just come at you guys with one of those and um, I'm, I'm thinking of going back with my crew you know and, and doing some work there it's, it's It'd be kind of nice, you know, just get on some tracks and just work, you know, make some music. But I also want to try to do some gamage too, so we'll try to kind of keep it mixed, you know. But generally speaking, you, you see my page, it is more music dominant. But now that I got this, I kind of want to chime in and maybe get a couple of, of games, you know, I haven't played. I mean, I, I like I said, my last PlayStation was well, PSP and PlayStation 2, so... I haven't really played many of the PS3 or PS4 generation games. If they came on PC, I may have, but other than that, you know, there's a lot that I have to catch up on. But, um, alright, you know, it's your boy FRWE. I'm going to clock out. I hope you guys have a good one. And like I said, just keep at it, man. You know, don't don't give in unless you have that, that guap hanging around, that extra money, you know. Don't give in and pay you know, a grand or more for one of these suckers. Get it for retail, you know. And and me, when, when I was first going to get this, I, I was leaning towards a digital version. And then after a while, I thought, you know, well, have, I don't... I have a DVD player, but it's not like it's hooked up. I don't really use any of my other old systems and watch DVDs. I, I don't have any Blu-ray players. So I thought, you know, I'm going to go ahead and muster up the extra $100 and get the disc version. And I'm kind of glad I did. So in case I want to play games, you know, I have pretty decent internet, but you don't have to rely on your bandwidth as much when, when you can go in and purchase physical discs. That's kind of nice. But, um, all right. It's your boy. <clears throat> Sorry about that, guys. All right. It's your boy, F-R-E-E, -E, and I'm going to clock out, and you guys have a good one. And like I said, kick butt and stay locked in. And if you're trying to get a PS5 or the new Xbox, just keep trying. Don't give in. Don't give these scalpers away, you know. All right, guys. You have a good one. Peace.